You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go! Hi, right, man, 15 Minutes of Fame. I got my guy T-Rex in the building. Fuck the system. Fuck the system. Y'all know what's up. That's the new shit you always got on now. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I do it for, for the stand for nothing for for anything. You know what I'm saying? Us as black people, you know what I'm saying? The system is what fuck us up all the time. So we might always say fuck the system. It ain't no race because it's white people that love us. You know what I'm saying? So you got to say fuck the system because the system is what's getting over on us. You know what I'm saying? And the system could be whatever system you want it to be. We we here we had black uh, black ink studios Harlem. Yes sir, yes sir. And uh, my man always taking time out to talk to me, man. Always appreciate the love. Come on, Unc. you know I got Unc drinking, I got Unc <laughs> drinking Scotty Dark and all that. Yeah, I got Unc yeah. drinking Scotty Dark, man. <laughs> yeah. What's Sipping up, on some shit, hanging out. Uh, let's uh let's start off with this man about this. Uh, you got a uh, QB. Um, you're battling QB on the Queen of the Ring. That's February 7th. Yeah. On that Watch the Throne 2 card. Shout out to Debo Babs. And, uh, Shout out to Vig, Dave, man. My peoples. Uh, how did that come about, man? Uh, you know, um, I was getting phone calls, you know, from Debo and I'm saying that, you know, something was something was up with Shayna. Shayna, um, sis actually working on her album. She had a bunch of music going on. And, you know what I'm saying? She was just a little overwhelmed. So she felt like, you know what I'm saying, I'm not going to go and half-ass it. You know what I'm saying? So how can you not respect a person that's saying, yo, I'm not going to go in there and cheat y'all. I can go get y'all anything and get this money, but I ain't going to even do that. You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying, Debo was kind of feeling a little funny, like, yo, come on, bro. You know what I'm saying? People, we promoted it. We sold tickets. I said, well, cool. I'll take it for it then. You know what I'm saying? Because Dot Mall, we stand up for each other, man. This shit is a family. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, don't think for one second that a nigga don't speak to shine. Like, that's my little brother. We good. Don't ever let these internet niggas think that we fucked up. That's a little bro. He, he family forever. You know what I'm saying? God is in his blood. But um, back to what I was saying, Shayna, um, I said, fuck it. I'll take it for her or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So me and Debo start talking or whatever. We got, I mean, I, this shit, I'm doing three rounds for damn near nothing. But the whole point of what you what you doing is you standing up for your for your team and your movement and your family. I'm saying how many niggas are jumping the ring with a female that can't. I'm saying no disrespect, but it ain't really doing much for my career. You know what I'm saying? So a nigga jumping there so they won't slam the sis, so they don't throw no shots at sis. So how can a nigga say I don't stand up for that mom? I'm saying I'm one of the fathers of this shit. You know what I'm saying so for me to be able to jump in there and say fuck it, I'm gonna go in here and do three rounds for 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 not even one round money. Oh damn. So you know what I'm saying sometimes well, the niggas. Well, for you considering, yeah. Yeah, you know these niggas be talking about certain shit. Our niggas is asking for a certain amount of money, but when 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 there's blood involved, you know what I'm saying the money is obsolete. It don't mean nothing. You know what I'm saying so. I'm gonna go hold Shayna down. That's all, you know what I'm saying? She'll get back to me on another note whenever she feel like it, you know what I'm saying? Right, man, that's good that you, st- like I say, uh, like when I was talking to QB, I was like, yo, that's some stand-up shit that you doing. Now, you've never battled a female before, am I right or wrong? Not on camera. Okay. Well, who, can we talk about who you did battle off camera? I battled Lady Luck. Oh, get out of here. I battled Lady Luck and Jinx in like 1998. Wow, no footage of that. Nah, Jinx and Juvie from Brooklyn. Shout out to Jinx. Wow. Um, numerous females on the streets, you know what I'm saying? Like, I probably can't really name them, but you know what I'm saying? Luck, remember? That's my people. Like you said 1990. 1999. God damn. Yeah. Yeah, like around there sometime. So now, for you to prepare for her, like, you real aggressive, you know, can a female actually stand in front of the wrecks of 2015? 2016 actually can a female stand in front of Rex and actually walk away and survive uh it's all on her you know what I'm saying that's how you take this disrespect you know what I'm saying that's how you take this aggression and and, and, and you take it I'm coming there to lyrically have fun you know what I'm saying I want to I want to have fun with this shit again if I can't have fun with it I don't want to do it so you know what I'm saying I'm gonna give myself a few things like this where I can see if it's fun still. If it ain't fun no more, then I'm good. I'll fall back and just watch, you know what I'm saying? You ain't gonna get your all and don't do it. So I think a female can stand in front of it. I I think, you know, that crowd is definitely gonna be 
female orientated, so you know it's going it's going to lean towards them. But y'all know I'm a nigga that never give a fuck about the crowd. I never give a fuck about what nobody got to say. I'm going to come in there and say some of the flyest shit QB ever heard somebody say to her. You know what I'm saying? With like what? Three weeks to prepare. You know what I'm saying? That shit wasn't like I took that shit last week. You know what I'm saying? So she she's say, disrespectful too though. <laughs> QB, she disrespectful too. It's cool. It's cool. It's a difference. It's a difference when it's God disrespectful and it's female disrespectful. You know what I'm saying? Right now I'm gonna be as nice as I could, but it's, uh, my, uh, my mouth gonna fly off the handle that day. And QB one of my favorites. She always been. She a Virgo like me, fly talker, aggressive, you know what I'm saying? I fuck with her, I respect that crab, so I definitely didn't mind hopping in there. If I'm gonna do the favor, I'd rather it be for somebody like QB. That's a hard worker, you know what I'm saying? That's that's about her business, you know what I'm saying? And she and she run with Swave in them, you know what I'm saying? So you know that's a Harlem family thing anyway, you know what I mean? So regularly you just wouldn't uh took a female. Nah. Even if they came with the regular check that you normally get for battling. I would have needed I, I would have probably took it. See, there's a difference then. If it if it if it made sense for me in that way, yeah, but it gotta be a female that I respect. You know what I'm saying? For me to even even be up to it. You know what I'm saying? Some niggas don't even get you up to go do it. You know what I'm saying? I ain't even battling QB. I'm battling the whole queen of the ring. Pretty much. <laughs> Everybody against me that did except vague. I know it. Well Tay Tay Rock, Tay Rock would be there, right? Oh yeah, so you, you know you Rock would be with there you. with me. Rock will be there with me acting the fuck up, you know what I'm saying? Tori Doe in the building, you know, that's extended extended family. She don't say Dot Mall, but that's family, you know what I'm saying? Think she's going to be rooting for you and not for QB because that's Queen of the Ring? She's definitely going to be with me. Without a shadow of a doubt, she's going to be with me. Farrah going to be with me, you know what I'm saying? If, if Chrissy I'm Yamaguchi pop up, she's going to be with me, you know what I'm saying? If Shayna comes, she's going to be there, hustle all. Like, you know what I mean? There's a difference, like, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm really niggas' family off camera, so you know what I'm saying? All right, now, um, now let me, let me, you know, be a, a little bit of an asshole. Now, you going to bring three strong rounds for um, for QB, or are you just coming to do the rounds and, you know, nah, I'm gonna come, get through the battle? I'm, I'm, I'm going to say they'll see me when I get there. You know what I'm saying? The shit, the shit talking was in my earlier years, man. You know what I'm saying? Right now, it's just time to get 40 points. I'm, I'm going to go there and act the fuck up. I'm going to give them their money's worth, way more than their money's worth. Debo, you still in debt, nigga. And um, is there anything else coming up for you? Uh, King of the Dot. It's going to be your second time on February that, right? 20th. February 20th. That's around the corner. Okay. King of the Dot. I'll be there. Can we talk about who you got? Uh, I don't know if they even want me to release that yet. Okay. So I don't really want to know what I'm saying. But I'll definitely be at KOTD two years in a row. Shout out to Organic Bishop. You know what I'm saying? Everybody that made that happen. You know what I'm saying? They're definitely on that card. Is that the, is that the uh, blackout card? Yep. Okay, nice, nice. I think Ice is on that card too. Yeah, man. Yeah. Be shout some Harlem up in the building. Shout us to Ice, man. Me and Ice, you know, they, you know, was, me and Ice been thinking about doing a two man. You and Ice. Weird, right? Not weird, but I, I love it. I love it. The old yeah. rivalry turn uh, companions. I like that shit, man. You, That's you know. pretty dope. You know, what me and what me and Ice had was a was a was a thing that wasn't for cameras. You know, and I like I said, I said I, I got out of character and said some shit that I wasn't even supposed to say. And me and Ice, we we, we we fixed that up, you know what I'm saying? I said some disrespectful shit. Apologize, big bro, I was in my feelings. But um, you know what I'm saying, me and Ice patched that shit up and it was uh it was it was over way before the you know, way before the cameras knew it was over. But we just had to keep the tension looking like that so we can get the battle off. That's why we only did one round, because we ain't really in the Harlem against Harlem. You know what I'm saying? There's just certain matchups that has to happen, though. You know what I'm saying? And that was one of them. Well, well shout out to, uh, I'm going to do this, uh, Hip Hop is Real. They've been doing a documentary. I haven't checked it out yet, but I'm, I'm going to check it out sooner. Uh, the King of Harlem. Um, have you been part of that documentary? Um, I've seen it. I've seen my face on it. And, um, Somebody tagged me and something. I seen my face on it and, and some, something like that. I mean, I didn't get a direct interview or nothing like that, but you know what I mean? Just mentioning me and that, I'm saying, is, is, is enough for me. You know what yeah, I mean? Those are my guys, man. That, uh, that look they give them for Harlem is dope. Shout, shout outs to them, man. I, I mean, I definitely do something for them. I mean, if they're your people, you know, it's only a selected few, man. You, Nine <laughs> Millie, Mr. Khan. I don't do other interviews, man. Uh, uh, now, okay, now, uh, 
are you just mentioning that you and Head Ice might actually do a two on two? Like I want to see how the fans feel about it. So okay. I'm saying let them throw it around. I'm saying let them throw it around and see how that feel. Well, they know now. Let's hopefully let's see what they respond about in the comments and see if they let's like see what to they see do. That. I just want to do what I want to. I want to evolve with the culture. I've been doing that. You know what I'm saying? That's what the T Rex did in, in, in life. He evolved. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I do. I I came from the from the era where it was on the corner. Whoever got the most rhymes went. You know what I'm saying? Then I went to Fight Club. Then I came back to the streets again and to start doing smack. Then we took that and took that to the World Series of Hip Hop. Then we took that and went to the URL. I was one of the first niggas to go to grind time. I'm saying I was one of the first dudes that, I'm saying, look at Total Slaughter. I went in there and wiped the whole house out. You know what I'm saying? I just want to evolve with the culture. I don't want the culture, you know what I'm saying? The culture is growing so fast. It can, it can outgrow you if you don't keep up. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just trying to fight to get back where I need to be, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes everybody get thrown on track, you gotta lose the game. Your best come up is a tragedy. So I feel like right now I'm just on the, um, on the verge of getting and wanting to fight again, you know what I'm saying? Two battles. There's only been two battles you didn't show up to. Two in New York. Oh, okay. Ah. Ah. <laughs> and what I think is Shayna was scared from the jump. When it finally got in motion, she got nervous and she couldn't write for me, like, cause these bitches got makeup stories or talk about.